Prince Harry has banned Archie Harrison's nanny from wearing a uniform because he didn't want his life to be like Mary Poppins. Harry's wife Meghan Markle has already reportedly gone through three nannies while trying to find baby Archie a nanny. The Duke of Sussex is said to have ruled out a nanny in uniform, comparing them to Mary Poppins. Instead, he wants Archie to have a normal upbringing. Royal commentator Omid Scobie told Yahoo's Royal Box this week, one of the things that Harry said was, I don't want a woman in a uniform around my child. This isn't Mary Poppins, we're going to have a normal household. Harry snubbed the elite Norland nannies who look after the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Prince George and Princess Charlotte's nanny Maria Teresa Borrello wears a uniform and is a Norland graduate. Ms. Borrello is required to wear a uniform at all times when she is on duty which includes hats and gloves. However, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have opted for a nanny that wears casual wear. Their chosen nanny was spotted wearing casual clothes while boarding a private jet for a holiday with the family. The couple are said to be besotted with the latest addition to their family with Meghan even calling her a godsend. A source told, Meghan is a very hands-on mum but the new nanny is a godsend. She is extremely professional, with a number of nannying years under her belt, and has fitted into the family really well. She's great with little Archie and just adores him. Harry and Meghan are very happy with her. Meghan's first two nannies have reportedly left their posts. The first one was allegedly sacked for being unprofessional while the second one was nights only. According to royal commentator Dick Arbiter, royal nannies were traditionally widows or never married. He told, when you become a royal nanny you are for all intents and purposes giving up your own existence. The nannies that looked after William and Harry were either widows or never married, the same with the Queen's nannies. So there is as well trying to find the right person who is going to fit the mold, be discreet, who will put your child's well-being at the center of their existence but be happy to give up a huge part of their own life. Prince Harry and William are still close to their childhood nanny Tiggy Legbork. Their young nanny played a huge role in the boys' lives after their mother Princess Diana passed away. Prince Harry even invited Tiggy to Archie's private christening which was held in Windsor. Tiggy retired in 1999 when she got married, but Prince Harry is godfather to her son, Fred.